Hey, welcome back Alpha Nuts. So after my road trip, the 4C is filthy. So I've got my buddy Casey here. How's it going? He's, gonna, he's a mobile detailer. He's gonna get me hooked up with a detail. And we got the Alpha Club coming in. <laughs> well, tell me about the business. Like, uh, how'd you start CPC? So I've uh, always been into cars, have had quite a collection of cars throughout the years. And from my very first car when I was 16, it was a 95 Buick Regal. And nothing special, but I still treated it like it was a Ferrari. Cleaned it probably every couple times a week. And then every car after that, I just always had the, uh, the want to just keep everything clean, detailed. So I've been doing it for quite a long time, but it's just finally gotten to the point where you know, it was time to make it a business. and yeah start doing it full time hopefully right on but uh yeah i just have that passion for cars in general but then make them look the best they can is of course it's been a big thing of mine so it seemed like the right business to start at least yeah, I, definitely, I definitely respect the side hustle that's for sure yeah <laughs> yeah it's a lot of work it's worth it i enjoy it it's a good it's, way to meet new people too and oh yeah they're car enthusiasts so i enjoy it does CP, CPC stand for something? Or? Casey's Precision Care. There you go. All right. Just trying to come up with a bunch of names, but all the first probably 10 that I thought would be good were obviously already taken. So <laughs> I kind of keep playing around with some different names, but ended up landing on this one. Right on. Yeah, that's awesome. That's an interesting blow gun. Yeah, this thing has been probably one of the best tools I've bought. Really? Like wow. usually with the, I mean, you don't have any carpet, but Usually, like before I even vacuum, I'll blow the entire car out. Right. And I can get probably about 90% yeah. of the stuff carpet screen with just this. Cool. I'll just do a white vacuum. Yeah. So it's got a little wand. So oh, yeah. it just spins. So instead of shooting just a direct air straight forward, it kind of just turns it all around. Like and thing. Just kind of cool. helps loosen stuff up oh, on wow. the carpet. That's neat. I gotta say, man, the truck is pretty cool. Thank you. <laughs> I like all the, all the supplies and like the implements and tools and everything built in. Yeah, so you filter and like soften the water or? Yeah, so it runs through two pre-filters, then runs through a reverse osmosis filter. Oh, wow. <laughs> so that's pretty much the workhorse. That will clean pretty much most of the mineral deposits. And then yeah. after that, it goes into the final stage of the DI resin. Then that just cleans everything else and then goes into the tank 100% spot free. Nice, yeah. Like I can wash this car, soak it down, rinse it off, not even towel dry it, and it'll dry pretty much perfect. That's awesome. No <laughs> spots, it's wonderful. Is that like a leather conditioner? Yep, this will help just kind of keep it soft. Has also UV inhibitors too, so keep it protected from the sun as well. Nice. Is this like a drying spray or? So this is uh, ceramic spray sealant, also hmm. like a topper for ceramic coatings so it just adds that extra layer of protection but it's also a good drying aid so as you dry you just spray a little bit of this on and right works pretty well lots of crevices to get yes there he is yeah it definitely looks nice and slick now this is the uh wheel dressing you were talking about huh yeah. for a tire dressing so you can use that on interiors like on vinyl and all that kind of stuff too but usually i use it just for the tires especially on more low profile tires some of the bigger trucks I'll use bigger spray bottles just so you get more out of it. Is it good for like rubber trim like this stuff too or? Yeah. Yeah okay. Yeah because like these I mean this is like sun faded unfortunately. Yeah I noticed but. some of that. It's Texas sun. It's no joke. Yeah it's pretty brutal. <laughs> That's why like a lot of the details I've been doing a lot of people just want interiors. Mm -hmm. They're all I'm not worried about the outside I'm like you should be. <laughs> like, a new paint job is going to cost way more than paying me to just protect it, wash it. But even if you're just doing like coats of wax over the last couple weeks, but keep up with it, it's better than nothing. So I understand a lot of people don't want to spend the money on ceramic coatings because it gets expensive. Oh, speaking, ceramic of, coating. speaking of ceramic coating, um, I actually put, before I went on my road trip, I put a like a generic ceramic coating like on these wheels okay does it seem like it's still on there or is or is it all gone did it just like come uh, off? i didn't notice much hydrophobic water beating on the wheels when i was washing them yeah there might still be a little bit on there 
Okay, well, good good to know. Maybe the, the ger their generic stuff isn't that great. <laughs> uh, which one did you use? I don't even remember what the name was. It was just like one of those like Amazon specials. Yeah, so sure. it was like it was cheap, and I was like, yeah, I'll try it. You know, and like whenever I put it on, it seemed like it was nice, but I just didn't know like how long it would last. And and a lot of those are still good to use. It's just depending on like if your car is in the garage a lot. Yeah, it'll last longer compared to a car that sits outside, is driven every day. It's maybe gonna last maybe a week. Right, set in two or three. Or if you immediately go on a twenty-three hundred mile road trip. That yeah. too. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, I mean, it's always good to still just use, you know, even the Walmart AutoZone stuff. Sure. Just keeping some kind of protection on the paint, the wheels, the tire. Does this sit in the garage? Like. It does. Yeah. I mean, like when I'm not driving it, it sits in the garage. So that's good. Yeah. Man. And then when I drive it, it beat the snot out of it. So <laughs> that's that's the way you should be driving it. <laughs> All right. So the car looks fantastic, man. Like thanks a bunch. So like, yeah, how can people find you? So you can find me on uh, Facebook, CPC Auto Details. Also on Instagram and CPCAutoDetails.com. All right. Well, thanks a bunch, man. You're welcome. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's a pleasure. <laughs>